So in this tutorial I'm going to show you this uh, cool website that I found recently. It's called uh, Restream. So it, is, uh, it lets you, basically what it does is it lets you stream uh, to multiple websites such as Twitch TV, Hitbox TV, YouTube, uh, Ustream, all at the same time and it doesn't take no more resources off your computer. But uh, first of all I want to let you know about this website called Hitbox I found recently a few days ago and I'm really like impressed with their services. They're, the viewer base is nowhere near as much as uh, Twitch would be and there's nowhere near as much streamers but I thought as being a small streamer myself I could maybe if I'm streaming on there there's nowhere near as much people streaming so I'd maybe I'm not competing with as much of the bigger streamers uh, I'd maybe draw a bit, a bit of a better or, audience but then I've also got over 500 view or followers on Twitch and I was wondering <coughs> how am I going to let demons know so this is where I found this website where I can stream on both let demons know, link my hitbox, and if they want to watch me in the future, they can come over to hitbox and watch me over here in the future. So, yeah, we'll get to it and we'll show you this website and how to set it up. So, you want to go to go to uh, Google or just any search engine and just type in uh, restream. Restream.io, it's called. You're just going to go there. It's normally there's an ad, this is just an ad at the top. It's normally the top link on Google and this is the website here so you're just gonna have to put an email in we'll just make up a just a, a random one here just to show you how it all works so I'm gonna go jelly dot com. just make up a random password start here right this is your home page now, if you're, this is for OBS by the way, uh, I, I'll probably do, I don't know if I might do one in the future for XSplit, they'll see what the demand is, but I know the majority of people use OBS nowadays. So you're going to need this link here, and you're going to need this here. Now remember this is a fake account, so these aren't really my streaming key or anything. So you're going to want to open up uh, OB, or OBS, and you're going to open this up again, just minimize this to the side so you can see them numbers. And you're going to want to go to your settings and broadcast settings. Put it, make sure it's on the live stream. And you're going to put this to custom. Put it on the top one on the live stream and streaming services custom. Now this this first one here, the FMS URL, is this one, the URL. Now obviously, if you're in the US or something, you pick a US one. Or if you're in the EU, you pick the EU. So I go with the EU. EU. So put that in there, and then this is your stream key. You're going to want to put copy this and put this in here. And then remember, don't let anyone see your legit state stream key. This isn't my legit one because then people can stream on yours using your restreaming. Uh, right, and that's you. Just click apply and OK. That's you done with OBS for the meantime. Now the add accounts. You're going to want to click say for Twitch add Twitch. Just click add Twitch. You're going to need your. Uh, Pick your server, which best to you. I always go with EU Amsterdam. You need your Twitch uh, stream key. I'll show you how to get that in a wee second. And you need your Twitch channel URL. And you put that in here. So I'll show you now. Just go to your Twitch channel. So you're going to want this. Mine is www.twitch.tv forward slash jollyjohn87. You're going to want to copy that and put that into the cha your channel URL. Then you're going to need to go to your dashboard and stream key. Now I'm not going to click show key because I don't want you to get my Twitch <laughs> stream key and streaming on my Twitch channel. So basically, what you want to do is you want to cop hit show key and copy your key and put your key in here and then hit add. Then you're going to want to do that. Same thing for YouTube. Get your stream key for YouTube. Uh, same thing for Hitbox, and same thing for you can add other services and stuff if you want to in the future. If you want, if you use any other services like UStream and stuff. Uh, yeah, there's a whole list of different servers services here you can use. Uh, but yeah, that's basically how you set up Restream. And then once you get all them added, you just go back to your OBS, 
and you click you obviously set up your source your scenes and your sources what do you want to display on your stream just as normal and hit stream and then once once that's once you've started the stream there'll be a list of all the the different websites you've added like twitch and they'll say connecting 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 then when they've connected they'll say connected and that's how you know you're going live to all the different websites and that's how i multi-stream to twitch and hitbox at the same time hope this video has helped you i'll get a video up in the coming days of how a basic obs setup for people that don't really know how to set up obs for just streaming on twitch just single streaming on channel streaming on twitch and if you've enjoyed the video and it helped you out in any way make sure you hit that uh, subscribe button like the video and leave any comments if you would like to see any more help on this or if you need any help with obs or if you just want to see one for xsplit just leave a video or a comment in the section box below and I'll try and get a video up ASAP for you. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.